I asked you what I should 100% this week, and we ended up picking Ultra Kill. For this challenge, we'll be doing all the challenges, like this one where I can't open any doors. We're gonna ride the rocket to heaven. I don't even want to trigger a single enemy. Okay. I'm already at the exit. Collecting all the secrets. Wow. I gotta go all the way back to the entrance. Crash Bandicoot? Whoa! Whoa! And most importantly, P-ranking every level. Sadly not including the Prime Sanctums, but we'll get more into that later. Chapter 1. The Campaign. The vast majority of the games I play on this channel are fresh experiences for me. Ultra Kill not being an exception. That comes at you really fast, but that was sick. But immediately, everything stood out to me in a positive oh. way, and I just love the way this game feels. Finish him off with a punch! Yeah! That was hype! That's an S. Easy S. My style should have been an S, for sure. Oh! That guy's gonna wreck me. Oh! Ah! Ah! Ouch! Ouch! Punch him! Oh, shoddy! Shotgun! 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 Okay. Woo! Yeah, come on, buddy! Got him. That's exactly what I wanted to happen. Boom, boom. Woo, woo, woo. Ah! We chilling? Oh. Oh, I see how it is. At least I can get my health back. Ow! He's just... Oh, there's two of them. Punch him. Right in the nads. That's one down. Oh, 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 oh. Don't die. Don't you dare die. Oh, thank God. Okay, first try. Ooh, minigun. Oh, yeah, you're done. No! Oh, what the hell is that? Jeez, man. What did I get? Oh? Oh? Let's go! What? Hideous mass indeed. No, he stuck me. Oh, I gotta shoot him in the cheeks. I gotta shoot him in the cheeks, man. Finish him! Yeah! This is a boss. Hello. Oh! Oh! What the hell is happening? Everything before B2 felt like a breeze in comparison, and I assume this is where everyone gets their first roadblock. I'm gonna lose. I'm already dead. Jesus. There is something I'm missing. Holy. Attempt after attempt, I ended up finding a bit of an aggressive strategy for myself in order to heal some of the tank shots I was taking. Yes! Yes, I got him! Let's go! After V2, we blew through every level see. before me relatively smoothly. <laughs> and made it to... Uh oh. Well... Uh oh. Why did that actually kind of scare me? Am I fighting a hand? No one could have expected the boss was a hand. This terrifying thing. Oh my god! Oh, did I hurt your feelings? Oh! Did I get him? First try, easy? The final boss of chapter one appears, and he's my only other roadblock in the first chapter. 
Cool. My only strategy I had for this fight was to throw an infinite number of attempts at him until I won. I'm dead. A complete foolproof strategy if you ask me. Ah. Oh my god, he's killing me so fast. No! Yes! Okay, good run. That didn't take long at all. Moving on to chapter two. What is that? We run to Mr. Elastic himself, who really wasn't all that tough. <laughs> God damn the sun! That was a long level. Never mind, I just suck. But shortly after him, we run into a new and improved V2. Oh, the really hard guy. He's on his throne. A rematch of the century. Ugh. Oh my god, he has two phases. Oh, this guy's gonna take me ages. Why am I already dead? Why am I already dead? Why am I already dead? I'm worried about P ranking this guy. Oh. Did I get him? Is that a oh, that's a checkpoint? Let's go. Oh okay. Okay, this is sick. What the hell? I'll take him out for sure with full HP though. Take him out with the pisty. You're done! Let's go. What does this hand do? Oh my god, that is so sick. We push through some more, nearing closer and closer to the end. The next boss-ish mini boss guy was the fairy man. He doesn't seem like a weakling. Maybe he's a bit of a weakling. Boop. Oh, now the music's picking up. Got him. First try. Let's go. This is somebody who is proud of defeating what will become, spoiler alert, a normal enemy in the future. If I'm being honest, the next level after that one, Ship of Fools, caused me the most trouble I had up until that point. Oh! But I really don't feel like getting into it, so here's the Leviathan boss. Oh, hell no, man. Oh, I fell for it again. Oh, I fell for it again. Oh, Shrinky! Oh, I'm dead. Got him. Let's go. That was a really cool fight. Even though it didn't take me that long. After one level, Chapter 2's final boss appears, and it's Gabriel again. Now powered up and ready to wreak havoc on me for another chunk of time. Oh god, this is sick. Well, here we friggin' go. I had shall relish ending you here and now! Oh! Holy! Is this what I want to? Already dead. Okay. Oh my god! This guy is destroying me. Oh, I finally got him to, my, to the second phase for once. Oh my god, he's going sickle mode. Oh, I'm so dead! Oh, I got him so low. Oh, I got him already? Wow. No. Dude, the amount of C ranks and D ranks I got on, this, on layer four. Holy crap. I'm so bad. Chapter two, the secrets and challenges. Aha. Uh -huh. Starting with the secrets, I think they handled them really Ooh. well and creatively. They weren't the type of hidden secrets you would normally imagine, oh. and I could actually find most of them without guides, which is a huge plus for me. On top of this, they've already implemented a nice little reward system for collecting these, which are in the customization of your gun's colors. Since showing off collectibles in games is never interesting, I'm going to show off the real cool secrets in this game, the secret levels. You have found a secret mission. The first one I discovered, unfortunately, was a mini horror game maze. Is this a horror level? I'm scared. It's very dark. He's like breathing in my ear. Oh, I'm scared. I'm scared. 
no, 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 no. Leave me alone, dude! Oh my god, I actually saw it that time. It's like a stick bug, bro. Where is it? Oh Jesus! Oh, 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 oh. oh my god! What the hell? Oh my god! What the f in hell, dude? Why did he just appear? Oh my! Yeah, I hate this level. This level sucks. Am I out? Am I out? Give me out! 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 Oh! It appears this level's gonna have a long-lasting effect on me. That's cool, what the hell? What's this secret? Uh, let me guess, it's another horror film. No, actually it was something much, much scarier. It isn't, it's a puzzle. Puzzle, puzzle. Hey guys. Puzzle Andy 64 back at it again with another puzzle. While collecting secrets, I discovered that there was a hidden alternative revolver locked behind three secret switches in different levels. Alright, so the hidden revolver is right up there. I don't know how to get it though. Oh, I can just. I could. Yeah, I'll just try that. That works. Click! Oh, I see you now. Oh! Cancerous? Rodent? I don't even see him. Oh, is that him? That was it? <laughs> what? Oh. Oh, no. Oh! Yeah, that's right. You're not so cancerous anymore. Boop. Oh, ho, ho. Okay. Oh, the collateral. Easy. Easy clap. So, do I get that? Do I get a new revolver? I do. Let's see. I want to see this. What is it? Seems kind of cool. It's like a magnum. After getting my super pistol, we move on and discover my next secret level. Heavy steps, ragged breathing. There isn't much time left. It might already be too late. It just... What is this? Is this a goddamn visual novel? The prettiest girl in town. Wow. It's done. And after speedrunning the visual novel, there was already another secret two levels ahead. Grab the moon dial. Wow, pretty. Crash Bandicoot? No way, this is, oh my God, this game is so good, what? Oh my god, this is sick. Whoa! Whoa! Who would it go? I love the way you run. Oh. No! Ah. Ah. Oh snap! For God's sakes, it's coming! Oh, oh my god, run. Oh my god, I did it. Fine. Oh! I missed some. Why? Electric railgun. We also ended up finding one of my favorite weapons, the saw blade launcher. Oh. After this, the last secret level was upon us, and once again, it was really cool. Alright, what do we got? I'm scared. Oh. All right, 
let's go fishing. It's Bass Pro Fishing, man. Oh, I see. Nice. Oh, I caught Peter Fish. Damn, the secrets in this game are kind of unmatched so far. I caught funny, stupid fish. Friend, in brackets. Ah, I hooked something. What is that? Dope fish? Oh my god, he looks horrific. I don't know how to catch the rest of these fish. Ugh. I need a bomb fish, and then I gotta throw him at this cave over here and open it up. Oh no, not more meat area. What's this? Ew, frog? I don't like looking at it, to be honest. Oh, I can fish in the pan. I got a stick fish. There's one more. Something in the ocean. Let's find out. Oh! It's a shark! Am I allowed to leave now? Fish size leaderboard. Where am I on the leaderboard? 62,000? What is this room? I'm dead. This room's hell on earth. Aha, the rocket launcher makes it possible. There we go. That was my last secret color. Ooh, it makes it all worth it. The grind has been was worthwhile because the colors are cool. Now we move on to the challenges. Get five kills with a single glass panel. How do you kill the glass panel? Like, do you gotta knock them in? The challenges are very fun, extra things you can do at each level. That I already failed, I think. These things can range from getting to the Leviathan boss in under 10 seconds or less. Alright, I did the challenge. If you're not touching any water in a level that's completely comprised of water. Ah! Despite wanting to show off me doing all these challenges, this video would last forever, so I decided to pick a handful of yeah, interesting ones of varying challenge difficulty. Complete. Starting with stage 05, I am told to not inflict any fatal damage to any enemy. The stage has two Cerberus bosses, and they have the tendency of blowing themselves up, luckily. Okay, oh, they blew themselves up. Nice job, bunch of hooligans. Stage one, four told me not to pick up Ooh. any skulls. Instead, find a secret way into the boss arena. While here, I randomly had the kick to attempt the P rank V2. Oh, I already got him. Holy smokes. And P ranked, that was quick. That guy was actually hard before this. And then you get all the broken weapons and he's so cheese. Stage 2-1 got me to find a way to complete the level without opening any normal doors. Alright, how am I gonna do this? <gasps> okay, I have an idea for this. We're gonna ride the rocket to heaven. I don't even want to trigger a single enemy. Okay. I'm already at the exit. That That's so cool that you can do crap like that. Right, Stage 2-2 two, two was one. one of the only full stages to have me speedrun the whole level. It took the memorization of all power switch locations and got me quicker at moving in general. Oh, it's right there. Okay, let's restart. Oh yes, I got it. Let's go. Stage 4-2 had me figure out a way to kill the insurrectionist in under 10 seconds. And while it was possible to burst him down extremely fast normally, I thought this method was a lot funnier. Come on. Oh god, he's coming. <laughs> Interestingly, while playing stage 4-3 for the first time, I knew that I would have to beat it without the use of a torch. Using the shotgun's bomb, I was able to partially see ahead of me and light the normal spots I was supposed to use the torch in. Crap! Oh my god, I can kind of see down here. Oh my god, I can't see anything. Dang it. Oh my god, I killed myself! Mmm. I officially can't see anymore. Are you freaking kidding? 
Oh, oh, what a troll. That took a while. In stage five, too, I was simply told not to fight the ferryman. Oh, wait, do I just have to give it to him? Oh, what the hell, that's so cool. And the last one I thought I should talk about was stage 5-3. To not touch the water was arguably one of the harder ones for sure. To start, you need to open the hidden exit with both skulls because the normal one is flooded. Now during the second half of the level, the ship flips over, adding random water spots all over the level you need to avoid. Yeah, blow! Whoa! Oh my god, that scared me. I really don't want to have to redo this level. Now how do I do this? Oh god, what is this? No, I don't want to even try this. I hate this. Okay, this sucks. Oh my god, I hate this level. Oh my god. What do I do now? There's no way I make this. Oh my god, I made it. Crap. Oh yes, okay. Chapter three, P-Ranks in the Prime Sanctums. So let's P-Rank the prologue, I guess, to start. All right, so I gotta go fast. And fast I win, easily P-Ranking and P-Ranking and P-Ranking. First P-Rank. Well, with a few interruptions along the way due to a few careless mistakes. Ah. The prologue was done in what felt like almost instantly. Oh my god. This level is so easy. Why didn't I just try it normally? Well, that's another P. P, P. Well, that P rank was really easy. P rank prologue. <laughs> Moving on to chapter one, it was mostly the same, and my confidence was overflowing. We're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done. Yes! Okay. Stage one three was my first small roadblock due to it being so long because you need to take both paths to get all the kills needed for P rank. I would also forget to trigger a lot of enemy spawns leading into an instant reset. Look at all these enemies I missed. I knew I missed enemies. I hit him with the McNasty. Ooh, ooh. I think I got him. That's not an S. Oh! Still not an S though. No, what am I? Oh, I'm out of time. Oh my god! Another thing that might have caused me unnecessary trouble was I thought you need to take out these two enemies in the secret encounter, which could either cause an easy death or make me run out of extra time. Okay. There's my S's. Did I get it? Come on, come on, come on, come on, quick, 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 open. Please. Yes, okay. That level was kind of hard. Once again, after this level, no troubles, many stages first tribe material, at least thanks to some of the challenges I did in the past. <gasps> I fell all the way down. Eh, didn't matter. <laughs> Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I'm so pumped. P for pumped. Eventually, we make it to the Corpse King. One weird thing with boss P-Ranks is that they're really just endurance tests. Since you're not allowed dying to get a P-Rank, you just have to restart and make the run all the way back to the boss every death. You can imagine how annoying this boss's path would be on death, so I somehow wanted to try and get it done in one try. Okay, that hurts. Oh my. Let me la Never mind. Beautiful parry. Oh my. I'm cracked. I am cracked. No damage. Damageless. 
With few deaths, we P ranked the next level and ran into Gabriel. Ooh, I'm gonna have to track this every time. And I honestly thought I'd be making the intro run quite a lot. Ugh. All right, Gabe, round two. No, I just want some heals. Oh, oh, oh. Second try! It was now time for me to attempt the first Prime Sanctum. I was going into these completely blind, though I was hearing that it was going to be quite easily the hardest challenges yet. What's this I'm hearing? It's so peaceful. Never mind. I don't like the sound of this. Okay. Okay. I'm kind of scared, actually. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my god! The attacks this guy has are so massive! Eyeballs have been destroyed. Oh, never mind. Okay. Is it laughing at me? Does it reach in all its health? Did it regen all its health? I'm... Oh my god. For the flesh prison, I ended up switching to the old-fashioned pistol so I can easily one-tap every eyeball. Yeah, this is way better. That way I could at least whittle away at its health pool. So this is how you do damage to him, right? Hey, 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 you're never gonna get this. Is it dead? Did I get him? Okay, I got him. Soul Survivor. Oh! I don't like the look of this. No, if I lose this guy, do I have to fight that guy again? Okay, okay! Oh! 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 oh. Give me a millis- Give me a frame to react! <laughs> I'm dead. Minnow's Prime was clearly nothing like anything else I've faced up until this point. He's just a little bit strong, guys, okay? He was like Gabriel, but quicker, hits harder, and was harder to heal off of him even. Stop! 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 Oh! oh. He takes no damage, man! Or am I just doing no damage? I can't even tell. Oh my god! I'm very worried about the second parts. Oh, okay, that was the best I've done. Many, many deaths later. No! I pulled this run out of nowhere. Did I get him? Oh, finally. Wow. Only 33 retries. Not bad. It was time for me to move on to P-Ranking Chapter 2. Chapter 2 was quite a lot harder to get P-Ranks on. There was a couple stages which I really struggled to get my style points at the S rank. B style? B style. And it was also significantly harder to stay alive on these stages as well. <gasps> Damn it! Oh, I knew it! Oh my god! 6 1 was easily the hardest standard level to P rank. Ooh. It was the hardest to survive on, oh. hard to track kills on, and for some reason, I just couldn't get my S rank in style. Oh no. My style! <gasps> Why? Oh. Are you? Oh my. Damn, that was cool. Damn, that was clean. Look at those style points. No! Oh my. 
my god! No way! It was down to just Gabriel. Again, another struggle for style points. I figure it was because I wasn't parrying enough and I was taking a lot of damage as well, so it was just a struggle to get used to him. My style's a C! No! Oh my! Yes! 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 I clutch up! Let's go! I did not think I had that one. You know, I'm gonna get a custom color on my revolver. Cha-ching! Alright, let's take a look at these pistols. Oh, oh how pretty! <coughs> Finally, just Prime Sanctum 2 stood before me. Ooh. Easily the most threatening and daunting level thus far. One that I knew for a fact I couldn't P-rank this video, thus I'll have to make part 2 in the short future because I'll need at least a week plus just for this P-rank alone. Oh Jesus Christ! That scared the heck and hell out of me. You need the saw blades. Why is this stuff? It's just a boss room of hell! Ooh. This music goes so hard. What the hell? Oh, awesome. I love this room, don't I? Ah, that chases you! Run! Oh! Oh! Wow, holy! I have to dodge in real life before you ask. Or else I'll for sure get hit! Oh, yes. This is a hard level. What? No! Oh my god. I hate this game. I swear to god. You really gonna hide the checkpoint behind that? Oh, this level is hell. I'm scared. No! Please, checkpoint. Am I sure? Fine. Do not approach it. Do not let it look at... And most importantly, have fun. Oh. There's a... At least there's a checkpoint. Wow, look at this room. Well... Looks like he's back. This person to I don't like when it talks. Prime second. Indeed, I have slept long enough. I'm curious about your skills. Oh my God! So die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh God! Whoa! I, where the hell even is he? <laughs> oh my god! If I can't see him, see him, I assume he's above me. Jesus! He needs... He needs... To chill, okay? I'm just gonna say it. Sisyphus Prime is on a complete another level. <laughs> the first boss encounter in a video game in quite a long time that almost made me lose hope. <laughs> He's just sending me flying! <laughs> when I actually finally beat him, it almost felt like a straight fluke. I'm not even gonna lie. You can't yes, that's it. No! Ow! This. Uh, this. 
Oh my god! You can't escape. Yeah, oh my god, I did it! What? I was so not ready to win there. Oh my god! Stop! Stop laughing like that. So, if you want me to P rank the Prime Sanctums in another video and potentially get to wave 50 plus in the cyber grind, please show me your support by leaving a like and consider subscribing for more content similar to this. Thanks, and see you in the next one.